You can now create this trending AI video. A cat taking care of her kitten while rain is falling. This is so beautiful. Now she is walking down the street with her children. Oh, what a lovely mother. Using this website, I am about to show you in this video. This website offers you text to video generation, image to video generation, and other AI tools that is going to be useful for you while creating content online. To get access to this website, use the link under the comment section of this video or in the description of this video. When you get to this website, come down and click on Get Started for free. And from here, the software is going to be downloaded to your device. Once it's downloaded to your device, come over here. You will see the software. Right click on it and then click on run as administrator and the software is going to be installed. After installation, you will find the software shortcut on your desktop. Double click on it to open the software. And here is the software interface. If you come over here and click on more, you are going to see there are different tools and also AI tools available on this website. Now, we are going to focus on how to use the text to video and image to video on this software to generate AI trending videos like this. From here, you need to click on text to video. When you click on text to video, over here, you are going to enter your prompt inside this box. So let's enter our prompt. You paste in this prompt that I just copied. At the end of this video, I'm going to show you where I got this prompt from and how you can get your prompt. So from here, you can select the duration of the video. If you want a 5 seconds video, you select 5 seconds. If you want a 10 seconds video, you select 10 seconds. Then here you select your aspect ratio, add a 16 by 9, which is the landscape size of YouTube. Or you can select 9 by 16 if you are going in for YouTube short. For this video, I want to create this for YouTube short. So I'm going to select 9 by 16 aspect ratio. This is the creativity level. If you want it to be more creative, you can increase the slider. Then if you come down, this is the negative prompt. This negative prompt is optional. If you use this, it means you are describing what you don't want to see in your video. For this, I'll just leave this empty. But if you want that, you can give a description of what you don't want to see in your video. After giving in all this, then come down here and click on generate. Now, to take a preview of your video, simply click on the video and you can see the preview here. This is the text to video option on this website. You can see how realistic this video is. See how cool and there's no distortion at all. After using the text to video generator on this software, let me show you how to use the image to video generator on this software. If you want to use the image to video generator, then come over here. You are seeing the image to video. Click on that. So from here, click on create, and here you upload the image that you want to convert to a video. I'm going to click on upload an image. So from here, I'm going to upload the image that I want to use. So this is the image. Now I will select portrait because we need portrait. Then I'll click on OK. Then after uploading your image, you need to come down here and enter a brief description of what you are trying to achieve with this image. What I usually do to get the perfect video, I use the prompt that I used in generating the image. So I'm going to show you all this at the ending of this video. Then from here, you come down, select the duration of the video you want to get, either 5 seconds or 10 seconds. After that, come down here and click on generate. And after some few minutes, your video is going to be ready. If you now want to go ahead to edit this video, what we are going to do, we are going to go over here, Click on it and drag it down to the bottom side, which is your timeline. So now we have our first video. And here is the outcome of our video using image to video option on this software. Now we are going to take a preview of this video. If I click on the video, you can see how cool this video is. So from here, you can now see that using image to video and text to video on this website, you can create this trending AI video and you go viral within no distant time on YouTube short or TikTok videos. If you want to go ahead to add AI voice over to your video, then come here and click on add text. Once you click on add text, you are going to see option over your right hand side. From here, click on text to speech. Then you are going to select the AI voice over artist you want to use as this text to speech. Now, this one, this is the one I want to select. So once this is selected, then come over here where you see text. Then from here, you can enter the text that you want the AI voiceover artist to say over your video. Another important feature here, you can use the AI copywriting 
if you don't know what to write, you just give the AI what to write and it's going to write that for you. So here, I've just typed in what I want the voiceover artist to see. Then after typing in this, come over here, click on text to speech, select the AI voice you want to use. You can click on this play option to listen to how this voiceover sounds like. Hello, let my voice add more color and warmth to your words. So that's how that voice sounds like. You can then go ahead and click on start converting. And that has been converted to voiceover under your video. So if you come down here, you can see this is the voiceover under your video. So we can just play this. Now we need to delete our text. So come over here, just delete your text. And if you play this video, you can see that we have a cool voiceover under our video. A cat taking care of her kitten while rain is falling. This is so beautiful. Now she is walking down the street with her children. Oh, what a lovely mother. Okay, so you can see how cool that is. So here you can then arrange your video. Just split, uh, split the voiceover so that it matches the video perfectly. So that is what I'm doing right now. So now we have just splitted the voiceover and arranged it perfectly under our video. Okay, so from here you can then go ahead to create what we call subtitles over your video. So that is going to help those watching your video in case they are not hearing what the video is saying. They can quickly read on the screen what the video is talking about. So to add the subtitle, come over here and click on speech to text. So it's going to start creating subtitles over your video. You can import a video from anywhere and see use the subtitle feature on this. So now we have our subtitle over our video. What we are going to do is to edit this subtitle. And to do that, come over here to the right hand side, click on style. And from here, you can see different styles that you can use for your subtitle. So for this, we are going to select a style that will be suitable for our video. So now we have selected a style we want to use for this video. Let's play it and see the effect of this. A cat taking care of her kitten while rain is falling. This is so beautiful. Now she is walking down the street with her children. So now we have this over our video. The next thing we can do is to scale it up so that it will be more visible. And to do that, come over here, click on text, and then come down. You can change the font of this text from here. Let's say we are going to use this font. Select the font, then you can make everything in capital letter. If you click on AA, here you are making everything capital letter. You can increase the font, font size from here by clicking on this plus button. So now let's go back and play this video from the beginning. A cat taking care of her kitten while rain is falling. This is so beautiful. Now she is walking down the street with her children. Oh, what a lovely mother. So now you can see how cool that is. So if you are satisfied with your video, you can then go ahead and click on export option here to export your video. So from here, you give a name to your video. So let's say cat. Then from here, you select the format MP4. Select the resolution from here. And then come over here. You select the file location where you want this file to be saved to from here. And come down there, click on export. And your video is going to be exported. But we are not done yet. Now, what I want to show you is the video translator function on this website, whereby you can translate a video from one language to the other. To use the video translator function on this website, simply go back to the home page of the app and click on video translator. So from here, you are going to import the video you want to translate the language on. So click on import files and go to the folder where your video is stored. For this, we are going to use the video we just generated. Click on open and the video is going to be imported. Now the video has been imported. What we are going to do from here, on the left hand side here, you select the auto detect. So for this, um, this language under this video is English. Then translated language. So let's say we want to translate this language to French. So we are going to select French. That is the language you want to translate the video to. Then you come down here, you can select a particular clip or you can translate the entire timeline. If you want to translate the entire main timeline, you click on this. But if you want to translate a selected clip, you click on selected clip. So now you come down here, select the style. If you want to add um, text over it, but if you don't want to add that, then you can come over here and click on auto subtitling. So let's play this video. A cat taking care of her kitten while rain is falling. 
So here, if you play the video, you can see we have translated this video to French. And that is why you are seeing another subtitle over this video. So for example, you don't want to have um, English subtitle over your video. You can export only your video without subtitle before using the translator function on this website. So now the subtitle has been translated to French. Then we can come over here, add a style. So we can add a style to it, and this will be under here. Then we'll click on animation, and then we can add the typing animation. So this is going to help those that doesn't understand English to also follow along with your video. Now let's play this video and see the final result. A cat taking care of her kitten while rain is falling. This is so beautiful. Now she is walking down the street with her children. Oh, what a lovely mother. So you can see how cool is that. So now we have English subtitle and we also have French subtitle over our video. If you want to know how to generate these images that I'm using, you are going to be using Ideogram AI. With this Ideogram, you can generate your image that you can then use on the HitPaw EduMaker. So from here, you just log in the Ideogram AI. Then from here, you select the aspect ratio you want to use. For short, it's 9 by 16, so you select that. So over here, you enter the prompt of what you want, the image you want to generate. After that, come over here and click on generate, and you're going to get your images ready. So this is how I generate those images. And this is how you make use of this hateful edu maker to create this AI trending video. This style of video is very easy to create, and you can do this anytime and you grow your page, either your TikTok page, your YouTube um, account, or any social media account you want to post this kind of video on. I would like to hear your thoughts, what you think about this website in the comment section of this video. Thank you guys for watching and do not forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel to support this channel.